Hey guys and welcome to this video about how to use subplots in MATLAB. The subplots is used to display multiple plots in different subregions of the same figure. And as you can see here I have two plots of sine and cosine in two different subregions. So let's see how to create this. First I will define an array t, so t equals to 0 with a step of 0.001 to 360. y1 equals to sine d, which means I will use the angle in degrees of t. y2 equals to cosine d of t. Now let's plot t with y1 and t with y2. So first we type subplot. The first two inputs to subplot create a matrix of a certain size that is used to divide the different regions of the figure. So if for example I typed 2 times 2, this means 2 rows and 2 columns so the figure will be divided into four sub-regions. The third input specifies which plot is active. So, for example, one, which means that this plot will be in the first row and the first column. After that, we type the plot function, so plot t and y1. Again, subplot. 2 comma 2 comma 2 which means two rows and two columns and this plot will be in row number one column number two plot 2 comma y2 and enter as you can see the main region is divided to four sub regions two rows and two columns and the two plots are ordered such as sine plot is in the first subregion and cosine plot in the second subregion. Let's try to divide the main region into uh, two rows and one column. So I will use the previous coding line and I will change the subplot function this time to 2, 1, 1. 2 comma 1 comma 2 now the main region is divided into two sub regions but this time two rows and one column let's see another example but this time with four subplots i will define y3 equals to y1 to the power 2 y4 equals to y2 to the power 2 Now subplot two comma two comma one plot t comma y one. I will copy this line. Subplot two comma two comma two plot t comma y two subplot two comma two comma three plot t y three subplot two comma two comma four plot t comma y four so the main region is divided to four sub regions two times two let's try another division i will change the division to four rows and one column And this is how it looks by using the matrix 4 times 1 in the subplot.